Hi, welcome back. Washington winemakers at the height of their crush season right now, and, and our industry is crushing it worldwide. Uh, Ellen Taylor at Soto Wine Works, Hang learning the, the fine craft, the hard work <laughs> of winemaking. Hey, you okay? <laughs> Ellen, you okay? What's going on? So this thing is dumping grapes on me, <laughs> and then I'm stepping literally, here, come on close. I'm stepping on grapes. I, you know what? I knew this is what I was going to be doing, and why I thought wearing a dress would be a good idea, I have no idea. But man, Ryan Crane, this is, you are one of the few people that actually stomps grapes and manually makes the wine. I thought only Lucy and Ethel got to do this. No, we do it right here at Chateau Curlew. Oh um, my gosh. This, this is Syrah from Resurgent Vineyard. Yes. And so we foot stomp all of our Syrah just like this, old yeah. school style. And we want to get more, <laughs> more texture, more weight, a little better tannin development. So we, we, we whole cluster ferment all of our Syrahs. Except for I'm noticing that I'm the only one that's stepping. You're that's not work. really, that's you're, work. you're not that's really doing work. much work over here. Now, Soda Wine Works, man, this is a spot where you can try like 21 different cellars. Obviously, this is probably the coolest one um, because you actually, coolest, yeah. you actually let me get in here. How long have you been like making wine and doing this whole thing? Has this been like a lifelong? This is, Ooh, it's cold. This is our 14th vintage. <laughs> 14th vintage. Yeah. So are we making I mean, I'm not, I don't really know a lot about wine other than how to drink it. Red wine, white wine. This here is red wine. Yes, okay, yeah. red wine. What's the coolest part about being able to like manually sum? Does this ever get bored? Or no. does this ever get? No. You know, I'm gonna, I, I, I've got to admit, I get to do a lot of cool things on TV. This is the most distracting, cool, weirdest feeling I have ever had working on TV and doing an interview all at the same time. I mean, what do you have to do in order to get into yeah, the wines? Working. Because, sorry, okay, sorry, <laughs> to get into the wine, because people are like, well, you're using your like bare feet to do this stomping on the grapes thing. Like, do I have to walk through a sanitation plant or? No, we like everything native here, so we're good to go. Na alcohol kills everything, right? Yeah. yeah, totally. Okay, so they've got, of course, a big Halloween party happening as well, and so we're gonna keep on working. This is a lot harder than it looks, just like stomping, and how long do we need to stomp for? Maybe about four hours. Okay, it's going to be a long morning. I'm going to need some wine in order to get through yeah, this. <laughs> um, coming up now, uh, not just stomping, we're going to be pulverizing, smacking, drinking, all that more coming up later this morning. But right now, Bill, i got to get back to work. Back on over to you. Yeah. Go, you know, go, I mean, there, there's so many good things right, about so red wine, but one of the no? real downsides to red wine oh, is that it yeah. does not come out of your clothes. So... Oh no, hope, do you think I ruined my dress, Bill? Yeah, oh I, no. I, I hope you loved that dress. <laughs> Past tense. I did. But hey, but I you're doing great like work. It. I mean, I that's did. the upside, and we're going to get some fine wine Thank out you. of it. So, appreciate you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm